Hello, dear listener. My name is Evelyn Hartley, but you can call me Evie. I'm an ordinary woman with an extraordinary passion for history, mythology, and the uncharted territories of the human mind. As a museum archivist, I spend my days surrounded by the whispers of antiquity, caring for ancient artifacts and preserving the stories of long-forgotten civilizations. But there's something about me that sets me apart from the rest. A yearning for something more. Something beyond the tangible walls of this museum. A yearning to unlock the secrets of the universe. To explore the astral realm. A place of dreams and mysteries. Beyond the reach of ordinary perception. It all began with a chance encounter. A peculiar artifact, tucked away among the mundane that would change the course of my life forever. This is a story of self-discovery, of unearthing hidden truths, and of embarking on a journey that would take me to realms unknown. I'm in the museum, surrounded by the hum of ancient artifacts. Dust dances in the sunlight, and the air smells like history. Today, like any other day, I'm here. Sifting through the past, uncovering the whispers of forgotten ages. My fingers trace the delicate patterns etched on a weathered urn, and for a moment, I'm transported back in time. But wait, what's that? Something catches my eye, a glimmer amidst the mundane. An artifact unlike any other, tucked away in a corner, almost hidden from view. My heart quickens. Curiosity tugs at the corners of my mind. I reach out and gently lift it from its resting place. It's a small, unassuming amulet, its surface adorned with an enigmatic symbol. Its energy pulses beneath my fingertips, tingling, inviting. I squint to study the symbol closely, trying to place its origins. My knowledge fails me, and I find myself on the edge of excitement and trepidation. Where did this come from? How did it end up here among these relics of antiquity? My mind races with possibilities. Maybe it's a fake, a recent addition mixed in with the genuine artifacts, or perhaps it's an overlooked piece of history, an ancient treasure waiting to be rediscovered. Theories collide in my mind like thunderous waves crashing upon a shore. I must find answers. It's like a compulsion, an irresistible pull that draws me closer to this amulet. I can almost hear it calling to me, whispering secrets from the depths of time. But is it safe? What if it holds powers beyond my comprehension? My rational self battles with the yearning for discovery. This isn't like any other artifact I've encountered. It's as if it holds a hidden door to another realm, a doorway to the astral plane, the place of dreams and mysteries. I weigh the pros and cons in the turmoil of my thoughts. My heartbeat quickens with anticipation and fear. But then again, when have I ever shied away from the unknown? This could be my chance to experience something extraordinary beyond the confines of the ordinary world. With trembling hands, I slip the amulet around my neck, letting it rest against my heart. Its touch sends shivers down my spine, a mixture of anxiety and anticipation. What am I doing? I ask myself, but the answer eludes me. I take a deep breath, steeling myself for what might come next. If astral projection is real, if this amulet holds the power to transcend the physical world, then I am about to embark on an incredible journey. A journey that could reveal the mysteries of the universe, and perhaps the mysteries within myself. And so, I close my eyes, and with the amulet clasped tightly, I take a leap of faith into the unknown, allowing the currents of the astral realm to carry me wherever they may. In this moment, past and present collide, and the boundaries of time and space blur into an ethereal tapestry of possibilities, 
Whoa, it's happening, the amulet. It's, it's warm, almost hot against my skin. My heart races and my mind races even faster. What have I gotten myself into? But there's no turning back now. I can't ignore the calling of this mysterious artifact. The bright light behind my closed eyelids intensifies, and I feel a tingling sensation all over my body. My consciousness seems to be floating, detached from the physical realm. Is this what astral projection feels like? I can't believe I'm experiencing this. With each passing moment, the sensation grows stronger. I can feel myself slipping away from my body, as if I'm shedding a heavy cloak and stepping into a new dimension. It's both exhilarating and terrifying all at once. Am I really leaving my physical form behind? Images and sensations rush through my mind. A kaleidoscope of memories, dreams, and fragments of reality. Faces of people I've known places I've been, and visions of places I've only imagined. It's like I'm flipping through the pages of my life in rapid succession. A sense of weightlessness envelops me, and I feel like I'm drifting through an endless expanse. It's as if time and space have no meaning here. I can go anywhere, see anything. Is this the astral realm? Is this what lies beyond the veil of the physical world? Fear momentarily grips my heart. What if I can't find my way back to my body? What if I get lost in this vastness? But then, a calmness washes over me, and I remember that I'm not alone. The amulet guides me, like a beacon in the night, showing me the way back. I focus on the amulet, on the symbol that seems to pulse with its own energy. It's my anchor, my connection to the physical world. As long as I hold on to it, I won't lose myself completely. The colors around me shift and swirl, creating patterns that seem alive with meaning. I feel a presence, something otherworldly, and yet strangely familiar. It's as if I'm surrounded by the collective wisdom of ages, the echoes of countless souls who have ventured here before. I can't help but be overwhelmed by a profound sense of awe and wonder. This is beyond anything I could have imagined. It's a place where the boundaries of reality are stretched and redefined. Time is an illusion, and everything exists in a state of fluidity. As I float further, the concept of self starts to blur. I'm not just Evelyn Hartley, the museum archivist. I am part of something greater a thread woven into the fabric of existence. It's liberating and humbling at the same time. In this heightened state of consciousness, I find myself tapping into knowledge and insights that I've never had access to before. Ancient mysteries unfold before me, like a grand tapestry, revealing the interconnectedness of all things. I'm suddenly drawn to a specific image, the enigmatic pyramids of ancient Egypt. In an instant, the astral realm responds to my thoughts, and I feel a pull, as if the threads of time are unraveling before me. The colors around me shift once more, and I find myself standing on the vast desert sands, thousands of years in the past. Before me rise the majestic pyramids, their grandeur taking my breath away. The sun hangs low on the horizon, casting a warm golden glow over the ancient structures. The air is dry and heavy with anticipation, as if the very universe holds its breath in reverence to this extraordinary feat of human ingenuity. The scene is alive with activity. Workers toil tirelessly, their sweat glistening in the sunlight. The sound of hammers striking stone reverberates in the air, a symphony of determination and unity. I watch in awe as massive limestone blocks are transported by teams of laborers, working together with a precision that defies explanation. It's not just the scale of the pyramids that captivates me. 
It's the spirit of cooperation and collective purpose that seems to permeate the very essence of this ancient civilization. Each individual plays a role, a single thread woven into the grand tapestry of construction. They understand that they are part of something much greater than themselves. As I observe this scene, I'm overwhelmed by a deep sense of connection to these ancient people. Though separated by millennia, I realize that we share something fundamental, a yearning to explore the mysteries of the universe, to understand our place in the cosmos. I see the architects and engineers, their minds alive with visions of divine proportions, aligning the pyramids with the heavens themselves. I witness the priests and scribes carefully recording the sacred rituals and wisdom that will endure throughout the ages. I feel the collective hope and aspirations of an entire civilization etched into the stones. And then, as if a veil has been lifted, I see more than just the physical labor. I witness the spiritual significance, the belief that these pyramids serve as conduits to the heavens, allowing the souls of the departed pharaohs to ascend and join the gods. It's as if the ancient Egyptians knew that everything is interconnected, the earthly and the divine, the physical and the spiritual. The pyramids are not merely monuments of stone, they are bridges between worlds manifestations of the human spirit's yearning to transcend the limitations of mortality. As I stand there, immersed in the splendor of this ancient civilization, I feel a profound sense of gratitude. Gratitude for the opportunity to witness this pivotal moment in history, to glimpse the wisdom of the past, and to be part of this timeless journey of exploration and understanding. But time is fickle in the astral realm, and the vision starts to wane. The colors fade. I have no sense of how long I've been in this astral state. Time seems to lose its meaning here, but I know that I can't stay forever. There's a yearning deep within me to return to my physical body, to bring back the wisdom and experiences I have gained. And then, in a rush of energy, I'm back. I open my eyes, and I'm lying on the floor of the museum, surrounded by ancient artifacts. My body feels heavy and grounded, but my mind is still buzzing with the echoes of the astral journey. I sit up, clutching the amulet tightly in my hand. A mix of emotions washes over me, awe, excitement, and a touch of trepidation. I've experienced something extraordinary, and I know that this is just the beginning of a journey that will forever change the course of my life. With a mixture of wonder and humility, I rise to my feet. The amulet, this catalyst of discovery, has shown me the interconnectedness of all things, and it has unveiled a path of endless exploration and self-discovery. From this day forward, my life will never be the same. I take a deep breath, feeling the weight of the amulet against my chest, and I know that this is just the beginning of my journey. A journey that transcends time and space. A journey that will lead me to unravel the mysteries of the universe and to uncover the deepest truths of existence. From this day forward, I am not just Evelyn Hartley, the museum archivist. I am Evie, the astral traveler, and I will embrace the mysteries of the universe with an open heart and an insatiable curiosity. The amulet has shown me a path beyond the limits of the physical world, and I'm determined to explore it to its very end. <laughs>